Hello, good morning, welcome to, I say, I always say good morning if it's morning for me, but it might not be for you, but anyway, welcome to a vlog. I'm going to be um, going to an event tonight at World Duty Free at Manchester Airport, so I thought it could be quite an exciting trip to vlog, and I'm also thinking about nipping into, uh, into Manchester City Centre first now this morning, so um, yeah, that's the plan for today, so I thought I would start up a vlog and see where it goes, and then I've also got a, um, trip to the Manchester Christmas Markets this weekend with some old school friends. Yeah, I thought I would start the vlog today. I am wearing this, um, jumper which I got from French Connection at Cheshire Oaks Outlet, which I did a big vlog and haul video on so if you yet to see that I will link it below and then I'm just wearing these jeans from Topshop which are like years old they're my favorite pair of jeans but I don't know the name of them the labels worn off so when it finally comes to the day where I'm gonna have to trade these in I don't know which which ones they are I think they're the either the Joni or the Jamie I'm not really up to speed with the Topshop jeans or they could be Lee I don't know. They're basically high-waisted and they're a little bit cropped as well. They're just plain, like, charcoal grey kind of colour. Um, but yeah, anyway. So, first stop, Primark, because I want to do a Primark gift guide kind of video, which, if it's successful and if that video is live, I'll link it below. And yeah, I'm so excited for this event tonight, so it should be a good one. We're actually stopping over at the airport as well. We're staying at the Radisson Hotel, so I'm sure you will see that later. And yeah, let's go. Okay, so quick outfit update just before I go. I went for this like long, really, really long teddy coat from Misguided. Uh, I'll leave it linked below as always with anything that is still in stock. I went with my Primark pointy heeled boots, my coach bag, which was also from Cheshire Oaks, but about a year or two ago. And yeah, ready to go. my car. Ooh, orange lights. So, very successful trip in Primark. I don't know whether to just do the Christmas gifts or or show you the clothes later. We'll see. Where's my phone? So, I'm just about to head over to the uh, Radisson Hotel at Manchester Airport, which is probably going to be about a 30 minute drive. Let's see. What well, one little trick that I do like to do with Primark in Manchester is drive to this sort of area near Moose Coffee. If ever you've been there, it's amazing uh, for like pancakes and things. So I will go um, to he, around this area. There's quite a few parking spaces, which you've got up to two hours. And I think it's about six pounds usually. So I just park up here. It's right behind Primark. So I can just get out my car, just do Primark, and then come back with big bags full, because Manchester is the best Primark, in my opinion. You always find the best, like, homeware bits. Ah, <sighs> I'm out of breath. Primark gift guide. Okay, I'll do the gift guide next Wednesday, and then the vlog, this vlog will go up the Sunday after. So, that gift guide will now be live, which is good. So, um, I'll link it down below in case you're interested in watching it and seeing what I picked up. And now, on to the airport. It's weird, it's almost a little bit disappointing that I'm going to the airport, but not going away. <laughs> I have a couple of trips booked in for the new year, which I'm not going to say anything about just yet, because it might be a Christmas present for somebody. Um, but yeah, so I will be back there very soon with my new vlogging camera. In fact, I am going to keep my eyes out for that because we're doing a bit of duty-free shopping. I'm going to see if they've got the 
the Canon G7X Mark II because that's the camera that I'm wanting to use for vlogging in the new year. If you don't already know, I'm gonna be vlogging every Sunday doing like a weekly vlog. So um, that's the intention, to keep my eyes out for that. If not, I might just have a look at Jo Malone, that's another brand that I love, or a bit of makeup as well. So we'll see, because I've done all my Christmas shopping already, you see, so. Um, I did most of it at, at Cheshire Oaks, which like I said earlier, I'll link below if, if you get to see it, but they had quite a few good bits that I managed to find for Christmas presents. But anyway, let's stop chatting, let's go! We've arrived, time to check in. Level three. Level seven. Ooh, super zoomed in. Let's get that zoomed back out. So I'm in room 748. 744. This is exciting. Oh, it's a superior room. Garden. Oh, oh, it's so pretty. Oh, I can't wait to like take this bag off my shoulder. So this is the room. We've got some goodies on the bed. I'll just put my bag down and show you what. Oh, give you a little room tour. Okay, so this is the Radisson Blue Hotel. This is what you see when you first walk in. So we've got a little coffee station here, which is perfect for me. There's me, hello. In here we've got some hanging space. Little bathroom in here. There's me again, hi. The bath. And they've got some nice products from This Works available. A nice ring light there. And then into this room, massive bed, which I cannot wait to stay in. Tom was gonna to come with me tonight, but he couldn't in the end. Um, so I've got this all to myself. And then let's have a look at the view. There's me again, more mirror space. See if we can see any airplanes coming in. Well, there's the airport. So if you're a good, if you're a plane spotter, then this will be good for you. Let's see what goodies they've left me. Oh, this is so cute. Okay, so we've got a little Christmas cracker here. Right, you ready? I'll pretend this is you guys popping it with me. Woo! <laughs> oh gosh, I've got to clean this up now. Little sticker in there. A little Christmas joke. What do you call a fake noodle? An impasta. And then we've got what looks to be Miller Harris. And in here, let's have a look. Ooh. Latte du fumage, which is a candle. Yay. You all know how much I love my candles, so that will be much appreciated. And then from World Duty Free, which is the event that is being um, held by. Let's take this out and see what's inside. Oh my god! Okay. Oh. Yes, yes, yes! I love makeup so much, so maybe I won't have to purchase any tonight. So we've got the Heavy Metals Metallic Eyeshadow Palette from Urban Decay. This is so hot. How do vloggers do this one-handed? There we go. With a massive mirror as well in the middle, which is good. And there's these gorgeous, these are definitely my kind of shades over this side. These warm toned metal shades and then these more colours. These more colours? <laughs> and then the more colourful side over there. Oh my god, thank you so much guys at World Duty Free. Much appreciated. And then we've also got a Bobbi Brown Smoky Eye Mascara in black. Yeah, black. I think this is a two pack as well. So some of these things might be... Um, good for a giveaway which I'm thinking about doing when I get, uh, hopefully when I get 10,000 subs. So we're so close guys but maybe in the new year I will do a big giveaway to thank you all. I've also got in here a little Jo Malone, um, what is this? It's a lip conditioner. I've never tried their lip conditioners before. It's got vitamin E in it and this is what it looks like. I was actually just thinking today that I need a good lip balm or lip conditioner so this will be 
hopefully this one will be really good. Very snazzy, very nice, thank you. So we've also got in here um, a little Yves Saint Laurent Black Opium. I love this perfume so much. I actually don't have any at the minute. I only had a mini sample sized one, which ran out fairly recently and it was on my list to repurchase. But now I've got this one, which is amazing. And then two more things. We've also got in here um, Benefits Hula Bronzer Travel Set. It includes two full-sized bronzers amazing so again another little giveaway in there um, I'm definitely going to keep one myself because I've always wanted to have the Huda bronzer and then lastly max look in a box B wow mini lipsticks times five. Oh my god you have spoiled me guys they are incredible this one in particular is very me I also really like browns especially at this time of the year and a nice pop of colour during the summer as well. These two may be in the giveaway, we will see. Uh, but look how cute they are. They're like proper mini size, but oh, love them. Can't wait to try them out. So thank you so much to the World Duty Free Girls. I'm so, so grateful. Thank you for inviting me on this little trip. And yeah, big bed all to myself tonight. I cannot wait. Ooh. I think I'm going to meet the organiser um, who I've been liaising with for a drink in a bit. So we're gonna do that and then we're gonna head over to Duty Free in about three hours. So I've got some time to just catch up with some work, do some editing, and then go and meet her for a drink and some of the other bloggers. And then yeah, we're gonna go to do some shopping and I'll see you a bit later on. And I've gotta tidy up this mess, look. <laughs> that is entirely my fault. What was I thinking? Just making myself a little coffee whilst I get some work done and yeah. Or galaxy hot chocolate. Which one should I go for? I might go for a mocha and combine the two together. I'm also very tempted by this. Deliver Blue pizza menu. It's available 24 hours. So I think what I'm gonna do is hold off for now to just see what our plans are. I'm going to meet the girls in about an hour. Or in fact, yeah, in about an hour. So we'll see what we, we do, but if we don't eat, by the time I get back, I'm probably gonna be starving. So I'm definitely gonna be ordering one of them. So just spritzed a bit of my new black opium on, which smells amazing. I forgot how much I liked it. And just gonna head downstairs to meet the girls. I've just seen a tweet that they've put out about the girls that are going. And luckily, of all of us, there's only one girl I've, n well, in fact, there's two girls I've never met. One that I've never heard of before, so it'd be nice to meet her. Just seeing her Instagram, it looks amazing. Um, I'll try and link everyone's Instagram and profiles and everything at the event below for you in case you're interested in finding out some new bloggers. Um, especially Manchester bloggers. But there's also a girl going who I've followed on YouTube for ages. I've watched her videos for ages. She's called Han. Oh, I'm just so excited to meet her. So um, yeah, fangirling a bit here. But um, it's a good group of girls. There's a good amount as well, which is nice because sometimes when there's so many girls, it's hard to meet everyone. Um, so yeah, so excited. I'm gonna go downstairs now and meet up with everyone. So let's let's go. Make sure I get my key. We've actually got to take our passport as well because, um, because obviously we're going through security. Okay, got everything. And let's go. Ooh, I'm nervous. I always get nervous before events. Why? So we're just off to get our security passes so that we can go do some duty-free shopping. I've just met up with all the girls and yeah. Let's go get our passes. Party in the Hi girls. Oh. <laughs> Got dark. <laughs> Vlog alive. Me and Anushka <laughs> having fun <laughs> at the airport. <laughs> Just Hi. arrived at the airport. Well, actually, we've been here a while. We? <laughs> Ready to go shopping. It's weird when it's December. Isn't it? it's great when it's December. Yeah. How all the airport should be. Yes. No liquids. Feel free to just shop at your own and meet back around the front of the store. 
Thank you. I feel like I'm, I'm following everyone. <laughs> we need to split up. <laughs> it's almost harder when you've got free reign to go where you want. So we're pretty much in the airport by ourselves, which is amazing because we can shop whatever we want. And I think I'm eyeing Jo Malone, Clarence, maybe Urban Decay? Clarence is a favourite of mine, so I'll definitely check that out. Oh, and Mac is worth a visit as well, apparently. So I'm going to head there now because that seems to be the popular stand right now. If you have honey, yeah, yeah that's the one. Thank you. So I have just been recommended the best perfume or fragrance I should say ever. It's the Myrrh and Tonka by Jo Malone one. It's in the black bottle so it's a bit stronger and a bit more expensive. But it's incredible. It's definitely going to be one of my new favourites but also one that I'm just going to save for special occasions because it's a little bit pricey. But I will show you everything I bought when I get back. And yeah, this is what the basket's looking like at the minute. A few of my like staple favourites in there, a few new bits. So yeah, I'm so happy with that perfume. It smells incredible. Oh, where am I going? <laughs> Head of the table. I know. <laughs> We've got the runway just there. We're all dreaming of places we want to go. Unfortunately. Oh, okay. Bye, ciao. Bye. 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 What a night. Oh, I'm so tired right now, but it was such a good event. I managed to pick up some goodies, which, shall I show you now or shall I show you in a haul? I might just show you now, actually, because I showed you the um, bits that they included in our little goodie bags earlier. So, I picked up a um, bottle of water. I picked up this, which is like a trusty favourite of mine. It is the Hypnose Mascara, which was about 20 pounds but if you got a gift set it was 22 pounds and inside you get a black eyeliner and a red lipstick so I picked that up a favorite of mine as is this this is the Clarins BB cream I got it in the lightest shade 00 I must have talked about three people into buying that as well tonight because it is literally amazing I wear it every day I've got it on now I literally choose that over foundation now which is insane I picked up a very beautifully wrapped Jo Malone goodie which it smells incredible I did mention when I was in there it was the Myrrh and Tonka fragrance that I got and everybody who's tried it has said that it lasts on your clothes for ages I picked up this because it's something that I've been wanting to try for ages it is the Naked Heat palette so cannot wait to try that one out picked up a little goodie on route to the checkout because um, 
I had some leftover money on the vouchers that they very kindly gifted us. So I picked up this little molten brown bauble with the shower gel fragrance, um, I think it's black pepper. It smells amazing, I smelt it whilst we are in the shop. Picked up a trusty favourite again, the NARS Radiant Creamy, Radiant Creamy Concealer. I've only ever tried the vanilla before and I've got a little bit left of that but it is quite, it's not dark, I can use it on my skin but I can't use it to brighten up under my eyes. So I picked up the lightest shade which is Light One Chantilly um, and then I also picked up another favourite of mine, the Instant Light Lip Comfort Oil which you know that I love, I use it in Honey Glam. This one is just honey so it's basically the same as Honey Glam but without the glitter flex. And then I also picked up this, which I'm yet to try, a MAC uh, highlighter. I got it in, I think it's the lightest shade again, Double Gleam this one's called. I swatched it in the shop and it was like the perfect highlight to go over my illuminator drops that I use from Iconic London, which I love, but sometimes if I want something a bit more dramatic, just that extra bit of pop on the highlight, of your cheekbones, if that makes sense, then um, I do like to use a powder highlight and I've never tried the MAC ones before, so I'm going to try that one out. As for now, good night and I'll see you in the morning. Good morning from this beautiful um, rainy Manchester's day. As you can see outside this morning, all the aeroplanes are about to set off. I have to say, considering this is like an airport hotel, you can't hear a thing. It's so quiet here, and I know last night, sorry, I'm a bit croaky, it's like the first I've spoken this morning. <laughs> last night, there probably weren't any flights taking off anyway, so that's probably why it was quiet. But like cars this morning, there are flights taking off. I can see the runway, which is so cool. And I can't hear a thing, so like if ever you need to stay at an airport before, or if ever you need to stay at Manchester Airport before travelling, highly recommend Radisson. I think it is quite pricey, but I mean you're right there. When you walk out to the restaurant area, you can see the um, like skyline walkway straight to the departures lounge, which we did last night. And honestly, it's so, it is literally right in the middle of the hotel. It, but, in the middle of the hotel, right in the middle of the airport, but it's a stunning hotel, um, service is brilliant, we went and had some dinner last night as you saw, uh, so I'm going to go down, have some breakfast, see what they've got to offer, and I will take you along with me so you can see what they've got, and then I'm probably just going to shoot back off home and just have like an admin editing kind of work day. I'm fairly hungry, I'm hoping for some like pastries or something, so we'll see. So I'd show you a quick outfit update before going down to breakfast. So these jeans are the misguided sinner jeans, I'll link them below. Really good value for money these jeans, I absolutely love misguided jeans and they fit really well. I get them in a size 8 whereas usually I'm like an 8 to 10 on the bottom, so I would recommend sizing down if you're in between sizes. Uh, the same boots from Primark and then this jumper was like in H&M in the sale for like a 5.0, it's ridiculous and it's a really thick knit jumper, I absolutely love it. I might tuck it in actually, let's see. Um, but yeah, this is my outfit and then I will be putting this one on later, this teddy coat again from Misguided. Hi, you okay? Yes please. Good morning, again another beautiful sunny day but as you can tell it's been snowing last night and in fact, it's very, very icy. It's not even powdery snow. It's all rock hard. So, um, today I have this cosy little uh, hat from Lasuda on because I'm off to the Manchester Christmas Market with a couple of old school friends. So, I... I don't want to take this big camera with me, to be completely honest with you, just because of the weight of it and carrying it around busy markets. Um, hence why I've asked for a vlogging camera this year for Christmas, so I can't wait to start vlogging more in the new year on that. It's just such a big bulky camera to take around with me, and I also want to keep this one separate for my 
like main channel videos. Um, so I might try and get a few clips on my iPhone, we'll see. Um, and yeah, I think it's going to be really busy today because it's gorgeous, like literally blight, blight brew, bright blue skies and um, all frosty snowy weather. So um, yeah, I'll take you along with me on my iPhone. I probably won't do talking clips, I'll show you what I can. And um, and then if I get anything, I will show you what I got this evening. New fragrance. After getting this at the airport, it is absolutely... In fact, I'm going to do a quick spritz now because it is uh, my absolute new favourite. I don't want to put too much on because it's so expensive. I'm literally... Oh, God, it's so good. It's so good. Um, that and also they kind of gifted us black opium as well, which is another favourite I've yet... I've never actually owned it, but I've always loved it. Quite a few friends of mine wear that one, so I love it so much. This one, however, oh my god, this is gonna stay on me now, for, like for at least for the rest of the day. So yeah, very happy with that purchase. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna head off now. I'm gonna catch the train so I can have a mulled wine or two, maybe a Bailey's hot chocolate in there as well. And yeah, I hope you um, are enjoying this vlog so far. Let me know what you think. And uh, yeah, let's go.